Welcome to Couple with the Queen, hosted by Jerry Tyler Swade, first queen of Senegens International and founding pioneer distributor. Listen in as Jerry shares proven steps to Senegens success. Hear how Jerry, as an international trainer with 18 years in direct sales, shares everything you need to know to have a thriving, stable business. Be influenced and empowered by knowledge and encouragement that Jerry imparts so that you will experience life-changing dreams come true in your home-based business. Hey, I'm so excited because I am in Newport Beach, California right now, and I have three beautiful, I wish you could see them, beautiful <laughs> women here with me from the UK. They are British. Actually, two of them are from England, and one is from Scotland. <laughs> and when you hear her voice, you will understand what I'm talking about. Oh, no, understand. But my name is Jerry Taylor Swade, and <clears throat> I am so glad that you joined in today to the Couple with the Queen podcast. I am super excited to interview you girls because, Ooh. first of all, I love hearing you talk just because of your <laughs> accents. And I know you say I have an accent, but you I do. do. I think you have an accent. <laughs> but you girls are so important to me for so many oh. reasons. And I think it's super important that people that are in direct sales mm -hmm. understand not just about the money you can make, but the experiences and the friendships and the knowledge that you gain. And that's what I want to talk about today is mm -hmm. how we met and all of the amazing times that we've had together and Absolutely. that you've had in this business. Yep. Yep. And so we are all Cenogens distributors under yep. the umbrella of Cenogens, yes. but your company is actually called Sheer Sense. Sheer, Sheer Sense. Sense. Yes. So can you introduce yourselves <coughs> first before we get started? Okay. Hi, I'm Karen. Um, I'm 41 and I live in London. Uh, my day job is managing a pet shop and my mum runs the grooming parlour. Um, and I also run a Sheer Sense business, which is Karen's Never Ending Kisses. Wonderful. Okay, and a pet shop. Yes, absolutely. My mum bought it when I was four. Oh, so it's a family it's thing. It's a family run. She used to be a nurse. Okay. And she used to work nights and then look after me during the day. And it was too much. So she decided to do something that was something she wanted to do, that she was passionate about. Right. That meant she could look after me as well. Right. So she bought a pet shop. And it was really, really small. And now, I'm very proud to say, it's very, very big. Oh. Um, and she started a grooming parlour. She runs the grooming parlour and I run the shop. Um, I'm so lucky. I love my job. And I get double lucky because I love my own business as well. So right, so I'm you a you, lucky, you lucky own, lady. Well, you actually own two businesses because you're a partner yes. in the business. So mm -hmm. you're you're you have a day job, so to speak. Absolutely. But then you also do your direct sales. Yes, and, and you're I one have. of the top salespeople mm -hmm. in the company, correct? Yeah, yeah. yeah. we all work very hard, and we're so you all... work a full time job. Yes, and you're one of the top salespeople uh -huh. in England. Yeah. I am, and I can't get over how much the direct sales has affected my retail business my concrete business. Oh, because you've learned so much. So much, oh. so much. And I've taught my staff so much. Oh, that's so I great. I have no clue about personality types or communication styles, or all, all sorts of things. Oh, that is so great. And I've so learned great. all of that through this. I know, direct sales does Ooh, that, doesn't it? Absolutely. Personal development absolutely. is so big. Very so Laura, huge. tell us about Hello. you. Hey Hello. girl, hey. Hey girl, hey. Hey girl, hey. Okay, say, say, <laughs> tell everybody why you <clears> just said that. Uh, well, I just walked in. I was like, "Hey, girl, hey!" But everyone here just says, "Hey, girl, hey!" Uh, well, not everyone. <laughs> <laughs> I think they do. But actually, when we get to the lower floor here, and the the lift goes lobby, so <laughs> I can't stop doing it. Every time I go in, I go lobby. <laughs> so I'm gonna go home, and I'm gonna go get a lobby. Every time I get in a lift, and he's, my husband's gonna be like, "What are you doing?" Like, hey, girl, hey. Hey, girl, hey. It's gonna be. It's gonna be. It's Everybody gonna be stuck in around England for a while. Is gonna go, oh my gosh! Okay, you're some extra. <laughs> so tell us about you. So I'm Laura. I am 38. Um, I'm a full-time mom of four children. Um, so that <laughs> what's the ages? Okay, so my youngest is coming up 12. She's 12 the day I get home. So that's Monday. Mm -hmm. um, and then I've got a 14-year-old, a 16-year-old, and a 17-year-old. Um, wow, so they're all you got a lot. Yeah, yeah. So they're all in like the end life, end part of 
secondary school? We call it high school. Is right. It? Was it yes, high? high school. Yeah. Okay, so Holly's go- will be going into um, university next year. Ben's going into college. So yeah, it's kind of a busy time. Yeah. But um, I fit my shoe sense business for me, and I think when you're um, a mum, you kind of lead yourself. Right. Um, you forget what you like. You forget mm. makeup. You forget your skincare routine. Everything is for the children. And you just forget you. And I just became this person in the background. I didn't know who I was. I was actually, like, at some point, I was really depressed. Yes. Um, I'd go around with, like, just, I don't know what you call them, like, we call them sloggies. The, like... Sloggies? You know, like, loungewear, yeah. like, oh, like, like, sweatpants? Like, yeah, I just didn't care what I looked like. Oh, you didn't care I what you looked like I didn't care like what it looked like. Oh, I had no makeup on. You know, I just hide in the background. And then, um... I just started following um, Ashley Gardner on, it was nothing to do with um, this, it was um, to do with endometriosis, which I had, which is another big issue of why I became such, um, almost like a recluse, Mm -hmm. because when you get um, a long-term illness, um, she had something, it was to do with like infertility, and she found lip sense, and I just looked at her lips and I was like, I need that, I need it, and she was like, you can't have it, and I was like, are you joking me? And she was like, no, you can't have it. We do not sell it in the UK, and I can't sell it out of the USA. And I was like, right, okay. So I did some research, and I found Sheer Sense. And this was like three and a half years ago. Um, so yeah, I became one of the first distributors. Well, you're actually the top distributor. I am. Yes, you're the top oh, distributor in I'm the company, I'm in the UK. In the UK, the highest the highest you, you have the highest ranking yeah. of anyone in the company. Yes. And that's because you started... At the very, very beginning. At the very beginning. But not just that. It doesn't matter if you start at the beginning. No. you got to do the work. You have to do I the mean, work. I mean, you can't just start at the beginning so the and be on the ground floor and think that's going to make you everything. You still have to do the work, right? No, because, like, every year, obviously, you have to re-rank. So you start from right. distributor. Right. The beginning of the seminar year. And so two years in a row. Right. Just consistency pays off. Boy, doesn't it. It does indeed. It does. Okay. Elizabeth. So, Hi guys, my name is Elizabeth. I am the Scottish distributor here. Scottish. <laughs> Scottish. I am 41 years old. I have three older girls. So my youngest is 15. My middle daughter will be 18 when I arrive home, same day. And my oldest is 19. So both you know, wait, you guys have a lot in common. You're <laughs> yeah, both 41, yeah. and you both have, we have lots birthdays of children, <laughs> of children on the home. same day when yeah. you get home. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's interesting. Um, and my two eldest girls are in university. Your two eldest girls, is that high school? No, no university no. is like college, college like do, studying degrees. Wait, when did you start having kids? <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, did I miss something? <laughs> I know. I know. So yeah, they're in How university. How old were you when you started having kids? I was twenty-one. Wow. And okay. I had all three of my children by the time I was twenty-four. Okay. And I was married. And yeah, 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 yeah. And they're in university. I'm very proud of them. My oldest is studying medicine. Oh wow. My middle daughter is studying social policy and sociology. Mm-hmm. And my 15-year-old is at school, still at high school. Very cool. Very so, yeah, cool. All is very good. So I wanted you to tell me how you started in the company. So I already run uh, my own business. Mm-hmm. I am a dance teacher to trade. I have a dance and movement classes for parents and infants. So when my children went to school, mm-hmm. it was really hard to juggle. So I started parent and infant classes. Okay. Then I have never really suffered very well with health. So ill health took hold and I had to cut back on my classes. So I've always been a very big advocate of volunteering, uh-huh. which we do as a whole family. We all volunteer with Girl Guiding, which is called Girl Scouts. Oh, Girl Scouts. So, mm-hmm. yeah. So we all do that. And it is a massive part of our life. But I needed, I suppose I needed another income or I needed something for me. When you lose something, because I danced every day. I taught classes every day, and then I couldn't because I wasn't well enough to. So this allowed me to still be me, still run a business, still be able to do things. Mm -hmm. And with Girl Guiding, it's a leadership role. So I had lots of leadership skills that... That you could transfer transfer over to your business. 
and oh, it's been that's fantastic. That's so great. That's really great. But then I've also been able to learn other leadership roles in this business yeah. that I've been able to take into into Girl Guide and, and into my other businesses. Right. Well. Definitely. Right. 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 That's so cool. So when we met, we uh, how when was that? Last year? Two years no, ago? Three years ago. Three years. No. Three years ago? Um, About two and a half, wasn't it? It was the pit stop. Yes, it yes. was September um, 2017, was it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 Okay, so that's when I was asked to come was over. Was it 18? Yeah. No, but wh- I 18. met you guys before online, though. Yes. Yes, yes, oh, yes, yes you did. I just you thought did. about that. Yes. That was now. our very, very first, um, and at the time it was called an influentials training. Training. Yes. And ten people, ten influential people, distributors, were invited to a very exclusive training and we were. We were there. We were. And you did a Skype training for us. That was it. That's right. I was asked to do that yes, for you. Came, yes, you did. Yeah, there's and, only 10 of us. And yeah. we did that for uh, yeah. several weeks. Yes. Yeah. 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 We did a training. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right? And I remember that. And I, it was so fun because I was like, oh, my gosh, I feel so honored. I get to train. Do you train. remember that you said making history and you had it on your screen? We, <laughs> we, we did. Did. We made that? history. Yes. We did make yes. history. We did. We did. Yes. That's right. We did make history. So we've we known you from so the start. Excited. And you've known us from the start. That's right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, and then I got invited to come over. You did. And did. actually meet you in person and train your mm-hmm. distributorship. And um, crown us. And crown you. you. Yeah. Crown yeah. That's you right. When you guys got your first yes. crown. Yes. That was you. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> you know it's so funny. It's like you forget things. You yeah. do. You know, you forget everything that you do it's because been a journey. we do so it has been a journey. It it's has. been such a great journey. Yes. What's your most favorite thing if you could say what's your most favorite thing about your journey as a distributor and as somebody in direct sales in this company? Sheer sense for you, Cinegens for mm-hmm. me. I've been in 20 years, so I've been in a long time. But what would you say, Karen, is your best thing, like best um, takeaway from being in this business? For me, there's been a massive education within business that's affected my business. But actually, the biggest thing has been finding friends. I had friends, I still have friends, Right. but the two ladies sitting next to me I would never have met in a million years, especially not Elizabeth. Right. <laughs> and we, <laughs> we met, we chatted, we went on these trainings initially and now we don't go a day without speaking to each other. Mm-hmm. A day without speaking not to each other? Not a day without speaking to so each other. So you are your own hub. You're 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 your own encouraging group. Yes. Like you, yes. you yes. guys are each other's mentors, right? Yes. And accountability partners. Yes. Absolutely. So you're accountability yes. partners yes. to each other, so yes. that you don't lose yourself in in the daily. But it's not mm-hmm. just in business; it's in life. Oh, okay. Yes. Yes. It's everything. Yeah. So you become you very good bond. friends mm-hmm. in life as well. Yes. So you know yes. each other's Absolutely. kids. Uh-huh. You, oh, you yes. know everything about yeah. each other, and we that. use a video chatting app. Oh, you so do? So that we actually see each other. So the kids see you all yeah. too? Yeah. Our kids know each other. And right. It just, it's oh, magic. Absolute magic. That is so cool. Mm-hmm. I feel the same way. I feel like my time of being in a direct sales company is the money is great, but there's just so much more to it Definitely. than the money. It and is. you just can't explain you that. You cannot. You cannot put it into words. Like People think you're crazy. Crazy. I know. It's like you can't. How do you explain it? How do you yeah. explain all the untangible things Absolutely. that you gain from being in a company, especially our company, because yes. we have such a great sisterhood, and we have a way for people. We have distributors all over the world now, yes. right? Yes. And we're getting more, like all the time. We just opened Hong mm-hmm. Kong last this month. Yeah. yeah. And so now I get to meet, and you get to meet mm-hmm. in the future, Hong Kong distributors. Absolutely. And, um, it, it's just so amazing. Like I feel like my world has expanded hugely yes. because of this business model. Yes. It, do you feel that way, Laura? Yeah, because I think like you say, like when you have your own downline in. Because I know you will in Hong Kong, or you have, should have already. Um, but then you've got new links over there, like maybe like 
three, four years ago, you wouldn't have had links over there. I've been speaking to people over there. It's no. just surreal, like, that you're talking to people all over the world, but you're actually friends. Yeah. Like, you have that bond, and it's just... Just think, like, five and years you do ago... friends. Yeah, but yes, I wouldn't be talking you to you guys. I, like, I've never, ever been to the USA, and it was on my bucket list for years, well, forever. And then, what, 2017, came here for Leaders? Yes. And that's my first time on a plane... On a plane? On a plane. Yeah. I didn't know that. <laughs> I had so, I no mean, idea. The amount of cherries I have popped with this thing <laughs> is <it's> crazy. <laughs> you chopped a lot of cherries. I remember. But it's all this. I know. I remember when you had uh, guacamole for the first yes. time. When we 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 because yeah, we took you guys Disney. to downtown Disney. Yeah. Oh, that was awesome. And you had never had guacamole. No, I live under a rock. I tell you. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, not anymore. Not anymore. No, no. no. Your head has popped I, up oh, from the I rock. Have, yes. I'm here. Yeah. Yes. So you're 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 like the uh, the mole that comes out and sees yeah. daylight. It's yeah. like, wow, this Whack world is amazing, yeah. right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's awesome. And how about you? Um, independence. Uh-huh. Independence. The company brings you independence because there's the flexibility to be as much, as big, or as small as you like. Right. Which is fantastic. Um, you get to choose. You get to choose. Right. You're your own boss. Right. So you are accountable for yourself. Right. And as a woman, that's that's massive to be independent for yourself. Because then you're teaching, I mean, I have three daughters. Uh-huh. So I'm accountable for me. So what I do, right. I have to set an example for them. Because they have to see mum does, mum can, mum delivers. And, and they and they see that you're they doing see, that. And they see that so that because you're a top salesperson in the company too. I am a top sales in the company. And you've got to travel the world I, now. Yes. And they see that. And they see that. And mm-hmm. that's really important, especially yes. I think as a woman. And, and as have, we're getting older. And as we're getting older, yes, definitely. That that's really important. Um, it cracks me up. You guys are still <laughs> <laughs> like you're not old. <laughs> no, I know. Like, we're in the babies. Oh, we don't babies anymore. I yeah. know. They're yeah. grown into like they're yeah. young adults. They're now. young adults. I they're know. about to. They're about. They're doing their degrees. They're about to go into the their world and start their journey. And they're seeing so you. You have, yeah. you have so to we set have that to example. You're doing the do. Yes. Yeah. And they see that. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. We're not just so when your mum rolls. We're not just housewives. We're not just the. Caregiver. The caregiver. Mm-hmm. We are all. We are. We and you're are not that. just going to a job and punching no. the clock. No, we are all that, but we are also our own CEOs. Right. We are o- our own businesswomen. Right. And we can make our world as big as you want it to be. Amen, sister. Yes. Yes. That's so yeah. true. And we get to share it. And we get, we to, get share. to share it with other people. I yes. know. Isn't Which it is great. Just awesome. And you get to share it in the podcast now yeah. too. Yes. Exactly. That's, that's another it. cherry pop. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody can yeah. do this business. Yeah. Anybody can do this business. There are so many women and men that are here to support everybody that wants to do something for them and for the or for their family or right. for both. Right. Yes. 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 Oh, that is so great. I I I'm I'm so happy that you guys came again. And I, so I say you guys, but I mean you women. You, you get well, I always say hi guys. That's why I, I say open. Hi you do too. too. Yeah. I do too. Yeah. All, all the yeah. time. Hi all guys. The time. And yeah. it should be said because it is apparent with us. Yes. That whilst I can recruit someone and Laura can recruit someone and Elizabeth can do the same and you Jerry can. Uh-huh. It's bigger than just your team. Of course yes. It is. You have been a guiding light for us. Absolutely. Right from the beginning. Mm-hmm. Like I said to you, my my sixteen year old yes. talks about Jerry Taylor's way. I and know he that always is so says funny. <laughs> your whole name. And he knows all about keeping on because of you. But actually within the business, for want of a better terminology, you don't own us. We're not on your team. No. Yet you help us, you mentor us, you teach us, you look after us. And us. actually, if you like, from a monetary point of view, you gain nothing, nothing. No. from that. Mm-mm. Yet you do it selflessly and it's hugely appreciated. Oh, absolutely. And that within the, I don't know whether that's the same in other MLMs, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Certainly I don't know. within I think, this business, I think it's there. The, the whole business is selfless because I get no personal monetary gain from any of you guys. Do you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah. But we all work together. 
Yes. Okay. And you every, help each other, help encourage each other, each other and yes. empower each other. Yeah. And you're not even no. like you're not you're not really encouraged. Well, you're on the same team, right? We all are. Yeah, we all are. But I mean, me and Karen, they're on like the diagonal lines. diagonally apart yes. from each other. Okay, I'm on Laura's line. first line. Elizabeth's on Laura's second line, on but an, not under me. Not an, oh, okay. No. No. Okay, so you're sort of sidelined yeah. in yeah. a way. Yeah. Oh, okay. But, but it doesn't, doesn't matter, matter, does it? it? doesn't matter. But in the real matter. world, like in the corporate world, that is not happening. No. That is not no. happening at all because there's backstabbing and backbiting and, you know, I'm going to climb over you, step on you, yes. crush you, no See, matter what I have to do salary. to get yeah. higher than yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. But in this business model of direct sales... Yes. And especially in our company, because mm-hmm. we know our company, yes. it doesn't happen that no. way. Mm-hmm. And, and that's what's so good. Yeah, because you're your own CEO, right. you're accountable for your own business. Right. So if you're not making those targets that you want to make, right. then it's down to you. Yeah. It's not down to anybody right. else. So you can yeah. have it as much as you want or as little as you want. Right. That's right. Really? But I always say, yeah. it's, if it's going to be, it's up to me. Exactly. exactly. Nobody right. else. It's, no. it's and that, you. You have to joy, do the work. That is the joy of it. It is the joy, but it's also the challenge. Yes. I yes. mean, it's not easy. This is no. not an no. easy no. Not way to live a life because you have to learn, you have to grow, oh. you have to force yourself you to, work. to do things you don't want to do. Yeah. You, you know, there's sometimes when you just want to be lazy, yep. but when you own your own business and mm-hmm. when you have goals, you're like, I can't be lazy. I have no, to. Yeah. I have to do the work. You have to get yes. uncomfortable. You have to yeah. get uncomfortable. That's and right. I'm a queen of procrastination. Uh-huh. I am. And well, I, you've learned not to be though. I I have to make myself daily goals that I have to get X, Y, and Z done. Otherwise, right. it would be two o'clock in the afternoon, and I'd have been scrolling through Facebook since eight o'clock in the morning. Yeah. But I have to tell me, just like a boss would, just, that. We right. need to get this, that, and the other done today. Right. Well, so you are your boss. Mm-hmm. I mean, you are yeah. your boss. You are. Mm-hmm. No one is telling you what to do, so you have to tell yourself what to do. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And you know, I always talk to my team about when you look in the mirror, do you see somebody that you would hire? Yeah. And if you would say, "No, I wouldn't hire me," well, then you better darn well fix that. Yeah. yeah that's because really good if you have to hire yourself every mm-hmm. day. Yeah. If you if you want to do this business, if you want to be and grow yes. and do the things that you are so open to you and there's so much available to you yes. in this business model, but you have to do the work. Absolutely. Right, Laura? Yes, you do. <laughs> <laughs> and you have to do the work every day. Every day. Every day. Be consistent. Every day. Be consistent. Yes. That is, that's it. Consistency. Consistency and yeah. persistency. Yes. Never give up. Never yep. give up. Never give keep up. Keep on keeping on. That's right. <laughs> keep on but, then, on. but then also give yourself grace. Because if yes, you, you do yes, have yes. to give yourself grace. You do. Yeah. Yeah. Because sometimes we all go through struggles in life. We all have our ups and downs. Yes. And just like everybody. Right. So it's just remembering to give yourself grace, but pick yourself right back up. That's and right. And that's when, mm-hmm. when you that's have when you have friends, friends and mentors oh, yes. and yes. accountability Abilities partners that help you. That help yes. you. Yes. yes. No matter where in the world you are. No. Yes. Exactly. Right. Yeah. Exactly. It doesn't matter because yep. of technology and everything mm-hmm. we have now. Mm-hmm. You guys. I, I've encouraged I you know, guys. So like, you've encouraged hey, me. Hey, Jerry, I need help. I need help. <laughs> I know. It's like, and we, and oh, what does there. this mean? Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. well, thank you so no, much. Thank you. Thank you. you. It's so great. And I, I'm sure that everyone that listens to this podcast is, first of all, going to love listening <laughs> to your voices, <laughs> but also the wisdom that you gave here today. So, oh, thank, thank you for inviting us. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bless you. <laughs> Thank you for listening. I hope you learned something or just enjoyed it. If you would like to learn more or hear more from Cuppa with the Queen and Jerry, subscribe to the podcast. I would love to hear from you, especially if you learned something or even if you didn't. You can email me at Jerry, J E R I, at couplewiththequeenpodcast.com. Thank you. Bye for now. <laughs>